So this is going to be the most pointless video you watch today. I promise you that. And I think you probably would be better off if you go find a kitty video or a dog skateboarding or something like that. You'd have a better use of your time instead of watching this video. I'm going to put that out there right now. I don't care. I want to make this video. So I'm going to make it. It's late on a Monday night. The video I was going to make for today, I decided to push till tomorrow, so I'm just going to make this video. Enough excuses, just get on with the point, man. I want to talk about the Grubbox color scheme. I told you this was going to be a pointless video. <laughs> but over the years, I've used many different official, professionally put together color schemes, if you will. Things like One Dark, things like uh, Material Ocean, I've used that for quite a while. I used arc dark and several alternatives to arc dark and i've used nord and i've used dracula i've used all the color schemes everybody knows exactly how much i rice because i every time i rice something i either post it on the community page or i make a video about it because i'm usually astonishingly proud of the fact that i put colors together that i didn't create on my own and made them into my window manager it's a weird thing to be proud of but the Grovebox color scheme, the one that I've decided I'm going to stick on for a while now, is, I think, and I would argue, the best color scheme that you can use. And I'm going to talk a little bit about why. So first, let me show you my brand new rice. Now, you've probably seen this in a v video for, I've been using it for about a week, but this is the rice that I've been using, and it's pretty new. So let me show it to you. This right here is... Grove box and it's DWM like I always use and I think it's utterly fantastic I, it's just the most gorgeous rice I've probably ever had and I don't know why I like it so much because when I first switched to it I didn't think I was gonna like it I've pretty much had a grudge against Grove box for quite a while and I don't know why I've always thought it was kind of ugly I, I I've seen I mean dozens and dozens of rices on Grubbox, on Unix porn, on Reddit. And I've always thought, well, that's kind of ugly, man. I don't want to, I don't want to switch to that. It's just, mm, you. Uh, and I don't know why. I mean, it's just, brown has never really been my color. And I don't think brown and green go together all that great. I don't think brown and yellow go together all that great. And it just, it never appealed to me. But then I was like, you know what? I'm going to try a rice that I've never tried before. And I went with Grovebox this time. And I spent a couple days perfecting it. And I still have a few things I want to tweak. I, I don't really care for the border of the inactive windows, that kind of like lime green thing. I don't care for that all much. I probably will change that to yellow or something. Uh, but, you know, I'll continue to tweak it. But as it is right now, I love this. I think it's fantastic. And I think... The contrast and of the colors is just supreme. It's a dark thing without being pitch black. And it's just, it stands out. Nord, that everybody seems to be using these days, Nord is too blue for me. I like purple a lot. Purple is one of my favorite colors. So Dracula is nice, but Dracula is just so cliche. I, I don't know how to else to explain how I see Dracula. Eh, actually, I think I'd describe it, describe it as more of a meme. Everybody saw DT doing Dracula for years and years, and they all copied him. I mean, I'm sure somebody used Dracula before him, but I mean, he was the popular YouTuber that used Dracula for a theme for a long time. So everybody did Dracula, and that seemed to be the thing to do for a long time now. And uh, now he uses One Dark, and a lot of people are using One Dark. So One Dark has kind of become a meme as well, even though it's fantastic looking. So Grovebox, I feel that it's very good because it's not as popular as those other ones, yet it's not as, like so off the beaten path is something like material ocean so you don't have to worry about a whole bunch of people using it but it's not so weird but also it just looks fantastic so this is all to lead into the fact that ricing is really cool i've made i made a video not too long ago about asking if is ricing bad for you and i continue to stand by my points there i don't think ricing is bad for you 
I, I know DT did a video the other day about it as well. And he came to about the same conclusion is that wrestling just is pretty awesome. And I have a lot of fun doing it. And I think I will continue to have a lot of fun doing it. So in the comment section below, I would love to know what your color scheme is. Do you like Grubbox? Do you like one of the other ones? Hey, did you come up with one of your own? Let me know, because I'd really like to know. Let's nerd out a little bit about our favorite color schemes. Let me know in the comments. If you'd like to follow me, you can do so at the LinuxCast. You can actually tweet me your setup at the LinuxCast if you'd like to show me a picture of it. That'd be cool. You can support me on Patreon at patreon.com slash LinuxCast. Before I go, I'd like to take a moment to thank my current patrons. Devon Chris, East Coast Web, Gen 2 is Fun 2, Marcus Meglin, Sven Jackson, Knife and Tool, Joshua Lee, Mitchell, Mr. Fox, Art Center, American Camp. Thanks everybody for watching. I'll see you next time.